Hi everyone, welcome back to Shalama Craft. I have a project to share with you guys and um, today is February 20 and it is, what time it is? It is 10.32 a.m. So I am going to do something for the first time, but I'm going to share with you guys what I did. And um, we are going to do it together. So um, this is my first time doing it. So welcome back to Shalama Craft. Um, do you guys hear some noises? My husband is doing something upstairs in his He's doing something upstairs. I have I don't know. I should I take this off out of there? I usually keep them like right there But the lighting I should put something to Put my light. I have a light like right here Like right there So I'm gonna share with you guys what I've been doing yesterday before I went to my doctor and um, my blood pressure finally came down to 146 over um, I think it was 146 over 99 and um, a week my blood pressure was 200 over 125 so I'm kind of I'm happy that it went down so I get to go back and see my doctor in four weeks and um, she said because of my body um, like if you touched it it hurts and she said uh, something about some kind of um, I have some kind of like all nerve problem so she said because of the pain in my body that's why my blood pressure keep elevating up so um yeah so i have to go back and see them see her in four weeks so i'm kind of, i'm happy that my blood pressure went down i feel much better today so i am going to share with you guys what i've been doing these are some, uh, my husband had a have a bunch of his old jeans, so he gave it to me. So what I did, I cut them in pieces. I cut them in different size. I cut them in different size. And um, I got three size over here. And they're perfect size for um, making a jeans journal cover. So the first one I did was this one and um, this is the one that I painted and I use all the paint I use is right next to me I use um, gesso on here and um, I use bl a black paint that's the paint I used and um, before I did that, I used this gesso. Is it just black? Yeah, I use this is what I use. I have it's still full. It's like really it's still filled up. So this is what I use. I put the black I put the black gesso, then I put black paint, and then I add I tried it and I add some more black gesso, and it's like really beautiful. And to have this pattern that I have here, I use this pencil that comes from Home Depot. You can see the paint is still on there. I use this pencil to make all these dots. And um, the bigger circle I used, this is one of my tools that I made for, um, like, you know. And I used this hair, the cap of this um, recycle pen that I made myself a tools to make the bigger circle that I put um, the, the green dot in there so I use this 
and to make the little circle that looks like um, the, the googly eyes I use one of these disposable um, crayon I took the top off and there was no crayon in it so it's a plastic tube and this is what I use to make um, those little the little dots looks like googly eyes and it came out beautiful I loved it I loved it these are some of the tools I use and of course paintbrush and paint and um, I'm just gonna move these back over here for now so this is the first one I did and it came out beautiful really beautiful so this is gonna be the inside and this is gonna be the outside of it so that's one that's one the second one I did it's beautiful it's a bright color it's really bright it's this one it's this one and um, it's the same this is like one side of the leg of the jeans I just cut one strip and then I, you can fold it and make yourself a cover and this one here done with um, the same black gesso and um, I used this paint can of paint my husband got me it's a lot of paint there and um, it came out beautiful and I painted the I make use a little brush and I painted the flower and um, I'm going to show you the paint that I use these and um, the yellow and the orange these are the paint that I use for this one here and um, to make all the flower these are the paint I use for these and this one came out really beautiful this is like a, um, a spring bright color I love that so this is another this is um, journal cover like it's, this is the inside the jeans I have a few I have like maybe five or six more pair of jeans old jeans for my husband so I am going to cut them and make them into journal cover and um, when I'm ready to put them on the cover I will do something different to the edge so it's not gonna be like that so I have one more to share with you guys and then we'll get into make one I did this one this is a smaller one for a smaller journal for a smaller journal so we got them I did this one this one and this one this is for a smaller maybe a smaller book like like that oh that's perfect look at that for a smaller book so and um, this one is have hearts and I made some little circles and whatnot and this one gonna be as a Valentine journal so these are the three I made and um, it's the background is the same black gesso white paint and um, I painted the flower with that um, apple barrel red and um, I made myself one of those little little DIY I just use one of these um, sticky back hearts and I stick them on there and um, this is what I use and I put in my heart on there so today I want to make one that's um, I want to use this I never use them I have um, I have a whole I have all of these they are not even opened and I got it, my husband got it for me like maybe two, three years ago and I never used them. They're still brand new. This one still has the, the tags on it. These are still in the package. I have beautiful ones. This is still in the package. This one is, has words on it. I never used it. All these are still in the package. So I decided to, and I store it in this um plastic container so I decided to try something different on one of them so we're gonna make one 
Oh, well, let's put this stuff aside. So, we'll put those over there. And I, I'm going to use a back paper, drop paper for the back so I don't make a mess. And we are going to, this is the paper I used yesterday, so that way I don't mess my own table up. I have more than one project going, so my table is a little, little bit crowded right now. And the extra paint I have on um, my paper, I just take it and I, these are envelopes that comes in the bill. My, for my husband save it for me. And um, I just take the extra paint and I just paint it on it. I I saw a lot of video. This is not my idea. I saw a lot of video out there. So um, that's what I, I'm going to do with the extra paint. I have a few more envelopes my husband gave me. Because he is the one taking care of the bills. So he saved that, um, the envelope for me. So I already went and I cut my... Um, piece of um, the jeans that I, I'm i going to use and um, we don't know I don't know if I'm going to use those yet so we are going to paint I have my brush I have two brush this one is two I don't know if I'm going to use this brush yet so we'll just leave it there for now and um, I have my jar of water my jar of water we got some white paint and um, we are going to paint this and I have to take my medication. I have a big cup of tea. My husband bring it, make it for me. So I'm going to get this video um, up. After I have to go for therapy for 1.30, so this should be finished. So I went ahead and I cut a piece off. And um, we are going to paint this. Uh, I usually paint the way the, um, the thread goes on here. So this, this side have stains on it. So we'll paint on the side that has a stain on it. So first we are going to paint with gesso. I have my little bowl here that I, I'm going to shake my gesso. I'm shaking it really good. And um, what I'm going to paint with it. I need a dauber tool. Um, let me grab a dauber tool so that way I don't have to get up back once I started the video. It's like right across here. I got it. So, um, I am going to use that for the finishing thing. So let's get this baby painted with um, my black gesso. This is what I use. And um, I want to say... Um, I got, I was watching, um, a video and, um, I got my ideas of painting the jeans from, uh, a YouTuber. My husband is coming down. He's got to go probably. He got to go. Are you going? Yeah. Love you. Love you. So we're going to paint this and I'm going to do one layer of gesso should be good. I'm painting it with black gesso and by the time I finish painting this whole pieces of fabric, the gesso is already dried. So I like, I liked it. I have the different, I have a different gesso, but then you have to use a lot of heat to dry it. But I, for me, this one seems to work really good. So by the time I finish paint my jeans with gesso, it's already, almost already dried. See, it's already in there. So um, 
I like this one. I might have to go. I got this one at Michael's. I got this at Michael's probably. Um, uh, I I want to say maybe about 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 three years ago when I first started buying stuff from watching all these YouTubers. I um. I watch their video and I take the name down of the stuff that they use and um, I go to the store and I just buy it and just put it there and didn't um, know where to start, didn't have an idea and a clue what to do and um, I was watching a video and she's one lovely lady and um, I I got an um, idea from her, and her name is, I am starting taking down name of people that who I watched the video, and um, her name is um, El Elizabeth, her name is Elizabeth Marie, something like that, her name is um, Elizabeth Crafty something. So I got the ideas from her. That's her name. Her name is Elizabeth. I'm going to show you guys again. That's her name. And um, she was painting jeans with just regular um, paint. And she was decorating it. And it gives me... And that's where I got my ideas from to paint, start painting and playing with paint. So yesterday, before I go... I went... Before I went to my doctor... I was playing with paint in um, in my jeans, and it takes me um, what time did I wake up yesterday? I have no idea what time I wake up, but um, when I get up, I came straight in my craft room yesterday morning, and my husband brought me down a cup of tea, and then he leave to go to work. He goes in and out, so he's working in and out. So, um, then I was like, let me start painting these jeans. And I brought the jeans down. And um, if I keep repeating myself more than once or maybe more, it's just because um, I my brain is just not um, thinking straight. So... So like I said, um, yeah, and um, his, by the time I finish with um, this side, this side is going to be already dry. So you guys are watching me painting this with black gesso. And um, somebody said you use it for canvas and it's good for canvas and canvas, um, painting canvas. But I was like, let me try it. Let's see how it works. So I'm trying it on a piece of jeans to make a journal cover. And um, I got a few more things in mind and I want to work on my um and my um life journey journal too. So I got a few things I want to work on before I go for therapy. So hopefully we get this this um one done and I want to try the tinsel on this one I don't I'm not gonna draw I'm not a I don't draw perfectly so I am not a uh, what do you call it an experience or ex whatever you call it. what's the word is I am not that I am just learning from watching videos so and I'm watching all these lovely people on YouTube. You can learn a lot. Um, guys, 